Hi, I'm Wes Whitley. I'd like to talk to you a little bit now about breathing and more importantly improving your lung capacity for running. Uh, a lot of this will actually happen by you improving uh, not only the frequency of your training, the efficiency of your training, but your ability to focus in on the type of training you're doing as well. More longer distance endurance type runs require you to be more efficient in not only your breathing but your movements to maximize the nutrients your body has stored up through your food but the oxygen you're taking through your body as well. Maintaining a good upright body position allows the diaphragm to pull the lungs in so that they expand more completely, bringing in more volume of oxygen for every breath that you take. Uh, when you tighten up, it constricts and reduces that lung capacity. So staying relaxed, especially in your running gaits, uh, will help improve your lung capacity in something very simple. The other is the volume of training that you're doing. The more volume of training, uh, the more, a greater response that your body will have uh, in utilizing oxygen more efficiently. So you may be taking in a lot of breaths and a lot of oxygen, but if your body's not conditioned well enough to use it efficiently, then you really don't receive the true benefit. So the volume of training that you're doing, the frequency and the type of intensity uh, will have a great effect on not only your lung capacity, but your body's ability to adapt to that and utilize that oxygen more efficiently. After all, if you're taking in more but not utilizing it, it doesn't do you very good. It won't actually trans translate to imp improvement in your performance. So by relaxing your body, training smart, you improve that lung capacity, and it becomes a great success in helping you improve your performance.